Hello everyone, my name is Raven, and welcome to Raven Gaming Labs, and welcome, welcome back to Vintage Story. I'm just gonna, you know, give me, give me my other pickaxe there. Hmm, well, I guess I was kind of working on this, this go around. Let's see what time is it? It is up, still early in the morning, so. And we're just gonna... Keep going. I wonder how far back we should take this. I mean, because, you know, we could just go straight down the middle and just have the left and right side, you know? Okay, let's see here. So, sorry I haven't been around very much. I've been uh, busy with some other stuff, and I did not mean to do that. I think that's far enough for now. I mean, you know, we can always increase it later. But this, this is going to be the charcoal room, if I recall. And we're going to have the charcoal be here. Let's see. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. So we can go one more over. One more over. All right. I love how crazy efficient that was. <laughs> hmm. I'm gonna go check on something really quick. I do have some candles. Six to be exact. I think we're gonna have to make some more copper plates. But do I have any quartz? Okay, I don't know why I did that to myself, but hey, I did it to myself. Why do I keep doing that? Interesting. Gonna need some more pitch, yeah. Nice. Oh, and it's only gonna take 24 hours. That's not bad. So by the end of the episode, that should basically be done the the downside is though is we are kind of starting to run out of tannin but i'm sure it's fine let's see what do i have here i'm looking pretty good i like the uh everything that i've made gives me all that extra you know temp boost there it's it's very nice And yeah, actually, after we get the strong tannin, we'll have enough leather. I'll be able to have full uh, backpacks here. Okay, sorry, I'm just I'm just thinking here. Um, so yep, we needed to go one more over, and hopefully not, you know, lose everything. Oh, interestingly enough, I don't really... Hmm. Oh, okay. I'll position it like that. That's totally fine with me. Ah. Now, I'm not really sure how I specifically want to do this, but I think for now I'm just going to temporarily... Uh, nope, don't want to go in there. I'm just going to temporarily, uh, let's see, I bet I put that over here. Where in the world did I put the, uh, oh gosh, where did I put the, um, you know, the other... I did bring in some walls. Man, where did I put those things? <laughs> I mean, they have to be around here somewhere. Uh, are they out here still? Huh. 
Oh, this is this is great. No, they're not here. Huh. I thought I had brought in some of these uh, walls here, but okay. Eh, it's kind of kind of weird seeing all this. It's like you know, we went through all of it, but yeah, it's kind of kind of crazy. Oh yeah, it's getting cold. Very, very cold. Alright, I'll just use these granite stone fences temporarily. Temporarily. There we go. That's all the charcoal. Awesome. Okay, so get that out of my inventory. So now we are going to need a 3x3 three three space, and I think we'll go this way. Um, hmm. I do have some packed dirt on me. So maybe I'll. Maybe I'll do it that way. I'm I'm just yeah you know, trying to visualize and plan in my head for how this is all you know going to work out. Uh, maybe I put it in. No, I didn't put it in here. Well, I brought everything in though. I give myself credit for that at least. All right. I'm gonna get uh, actually two should be more than enough. I'm gonna make some, you know, just, we, we, we have to make some more, uh, I'm gonna want this, and then my trusty hammer, and it's like five in the morning, but hey, whatever, we don't sleep, ever, and so, now we just kind of wait, I'm gonna make, like I said, I'm gonna make some more lanterns, we really, really need more lanterns. Oh, yeah. Let's see here. Go ahead and throw this in, and then I guess I can go ahead and just eat some of the carrot pie there. We should have more than enough. But, uh, yeah. The good news, though, is that I actually think that since basically everything is moved inside now, we, for the most part, I mean, we have basically everything we need, which is, which is pretty cool. Yeah, I think it takes two to make one plate. It's, it has been a little while, because I think it's been like 10 or 11 days now since the last episode, so... A lot of time has passed. Yep. No, I don't want that. I do want the heavy hit, though. Hey, hang on. Ah. I'm having to do things the proper way, as some people have pointed out to me. Personally, I don't really believe in the proper way, but, you know. You guys all do, you know, you, you know. Got your, you got your method, I got mine, you know. It's, it's whatever. It's fine, I'm sure it's fine. You know, whatever works. It's all that matters, you know, at the end of the day. Get the job done. After all, it's just vintage story. It's not like it's, you know, anything, uh, whoops. 
important or anything like that. It's just a game. Some people, uh, whoops. Well, okay then. Uh, yeah, there we go. And we are almost done. Hooray us. Oof. Ah, you know what? I remember one thing that I was going to do, and I was going to put in a, uh, a water source in here, and I will probably do that almost uh, immediately. Let's go do that right now. Go throw it in. That can just hang out in there. Um, all right, so we know we're not going to go this way. Like, we're not going to, you know, bust through the wall here. Uh, we may end up expanding that, but... For now, what we'll do is we'll just do really. Oh my. Okay. Thanks. Thanks, game. I completely wait, 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 wait. Oh. This is definitely done. It's like you haven't played in almost two weeks. You've forgotten the most important thing, which is Yeah. Oops. Why is it not? Oh, come on. There we go. And I'll put this back, and then I'll just put this bucket back, because, you know, we obviously don't need to be messing with that. And so, we will also go this way. And... Yeah, Alright, so I need to get a lot of this stuff out of my inventory. Uh, but before that, I'm gonna run over here. Grab the clear quartz. Wow, it looks cold out there. Because it is very cold out here. Crazy. Ah, oh, it's negative three outside. I'm very glad I have all this fur and other stuff on me. Alright, so we're going to put a candle there. We're going to put the plate there. And then we're going to put two of these here. And lo and behold, we get a copper lantern. Yay. Alright, I'll just throw that over there. Throw that. Oh, they were right there the whole time. Someone's going to point that out in the video. And hopefully they'll still watch where I do eventually stop being ridiculous and notice the obvious. Anyway, that aside, I am going to put this not right there because that is like way too much in my face. Uh, Right there. There we go. Perfect. Because that'll light all of this whole area right here. And it won't be as dark. Obviously, of course, we do need more of those. But again, that is another nighttime-ish activity. I'm going to throw that in there just because. And wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh, yep, okay. We, we, need, we need way more. Um, all right, so let me just take a little look at this here. Mm, yeah, this is all gravel. So we're going to go up somewhere, maybe over here. And we're going to start har harvesting. But before we do that, I'm going to be smart about this and grab some food for the journey. Yes. Wow. Uh, almost three years. How oh, winter time is great. I mean, this isn't even like an underground cellar. I mean, if I really wanted to, we could have a really deep cellar that's just... I'm, I'm just going to leave them alone. This looks nice, though. Like, 
seriously, this this looks really, really pretty. I like this. The, the frost, you know? I'm going to get a nice little screenshot of this. Hang on. I just... There we go. Need one of my tools out. Yep, there we go. That's the money maker right there. I mean, is it really? Probably not. But we're rolling with it. Oh, yes, we are. Yep. And then what we're going to do is we're going to tear... Well, we'll probably leave this up for a while, but eventually all of this will also be torn down. Because um, we don't need it anymore. So, why have it? I mean, you know. Why have it? Very nice view, though. I, I do enjoy uh, this. Oh, yeah, I should probably bring in all that as well, but... We will get there. But first, we need to run this way. Now, I can't believe this is like episode... Mm, I want to say 36. can't believe this is like one of the longest running, you know... Oh my gosh! That was a bear. I was like, hey, that looks like a bear. Yeah, that was that was a bear. I'm so glad you noticed. Man, those things are super aggressive. As far as this thing gonna chase me, I'm gonna have to deal with it, aren't I? No, nah, we're good. We're good. We're good. I'm gonna have to deal with the bear. Because, you know, wolves are one thing. They're annoying. You know? Bears. Bears are a whole other ballpark of... I don't like them. Out of the way, it's a little... It's a little difficult to do this while... Basically being positioned way up here. On the upside, though... It'll give me a lot more uh, hide to work with. Alright. I probably really should make some nice uh, copper tools. Or spears, I guess. And this is why I, I always carry flint, because while it may not do the most amount of damage, at least I have something that I can build a defense or something with, you know? And bears do actually, uh, they, they, uh, yeah, bears, bears are bad. Very bad. Bears are bad. Really bad. Okay. Well, there goes. My, my game plan is completely thrown out of the oh yeah, I was about to say I probably should have uh you know looked around a little first but um hmm. I thought it was like a wolf or something when I ran by it I didn't I didn't realize it was a sleeping bear there's the bear I'm not really sure what to make of that. I'm just kind of used to... Maybe it'll get close. And then aggro? Like, what's the deal here? It's not going to do that. Oh, it did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I assure you that I do not care. Uh, okay, kind of weird. I don't know why I did that. Okay, that worked. 
I mean... That really wasn't the game plan. It really... I... Okay. And I really hate it when it does that too. All this gravel. This stuff is the worst. I just want my spear back. There we go. I don't even... Don't even think that was worth it either, but... I mean, yeah, whatever. I mean, what are you, what are you gonna do? Anyway, now that we've taken care of that, I guess. I'm just gonna eat both of these. I'm going to just casually stroll on over here to where the old idea of where I was gonna put a quarry. Actually, to be fair, this quarry's proven to be kinda nice. Largely due to the whole uh, the copper that was found buried under it. That was quite nice, actually. I thoroughly enjoyed that. And I know I should be, you know, harvesting a lot of this, but I'm not going to, so. Okay, maybe not get that close to it, but, yeah. Well, that's nice. Oh, there were parsnips in there. Oops. This whole area was once beautiful, and now it's just a testament to my ability to destroy the natural beauty of everything in my never-ending quest for roads. I mean, let's be real. That's pretty much what this is all about. It's just about me getting more resources to uh, mass build roads and turn this whole area into a horrible, disgusting mess. Because that's... Yep, that's what I'm doing. crazy. Oh. Well, that's thoughtful. Go oh, into the hole. Thank you. Oh, yeah. The, the, this just instantly... I, I know I'm gonna have to probably, like, spawn cheat in uh, some stuff, and that's gonna suck. The good news, though, is once I have a road, I'll be able to travel much further, and I won't have to destroy my local environment as often. But this should be sort of enough, I guess. Um, yeah, that should be enough. Also, like I said, I've got some parsnips out of it. And a bunch more spears. And two raw hides. Uh, large raw hats. I don't even understand how that was even growing, but I I guess anything is possible. Res. Since I have no desire to get rid of that tree back there, it'll. I'm kind of okay with that stain. Ah. Oh. Oh, I'm glad I came back this way. Nice. And the best part, there's going to be plenty of time for... Well, should be plenty of time for other things as well. You know, like... 
Okay, uh, what did we get? Didn't I have a chest for, like, flowers? I guess I didn't. I just threw them in there. Fair enough. This will now be the flower chest. And it is very full of flowers. Put the resin in there. Also, I realize the seeds are over here. That's another thing that I truly do wish to do. I know I'm not going to be able to build the greenhouses. I mean, technically, I could build the greenhouses. There's enough quartz around here that I could. I could also build a bloomery and just make an enormous amount of glass. Um, I see. Throw the bones in there. But uh, mm, I'm not really too sure if that's something that I really want to do at the moment. Give me that back. Why in the world did I do that? No, no, no. I know why I did that. Nice. The weapon collection. The weapon wall. Just an army of spears. It's good. Okay. Uh, let's go in here and... You know what? I'll put that in here. Because that should still last for quite a few days. I'll put the large rawhide here. And what do we have? We have 18 days to do something with it. Not fair enough. And we have 19. So I guess push comes to shove. I'll just turn it all into pelts. Not exactly what I really want to do with it. But, you know, it certainly beats doing anything else with it. All right, let's grab these. And I will just throw all of this in here. And then I'll take out three. And that should be good. Now we will run all the way up here. Go into here. How are we doing? Pretty good. And now for the long and very difficult. Okay, perfect. And this works out kind of well because now we can just we could just go work. There's plenty of there's plenty to do. Do we have another shovel? We do. Okay, good. I don't think we're gonna need it, but we might. You never know. I didn't grab any food, but... Oh, that looks nice. I'm going to have to harvest that at some point. So it can grow again. I mean, I know it's dark, but I can work when it's dark. It's not preferable, but I can do it. And for better or for worse, this is definitely something that needs to be done. Let me get all this crap out of the way. Actually, I'm going to put one of those in here. Now, the real question begin needs to be asked, how exactly do I want to do this? Because I could continue to just... We'll figure it out, I guess. I guess this is what we're going to be doing. The main upside to, um, you know, what we're eventually going to have 
you know, when we start hitting the the grass area is at least as we remove chunks of the road or, you know, the area, at least we'll have something. Um, so let's see, where exactly do I need to start turning? Oh, boy. Uh, no, actually, I don't need to start turning at all. Uh, nope, I just got to keep on going. Oh, wow. Just keep going straight. That is... That is the game there. Just, just keep going. This is in the way there. Kind of unfortunate that I can't do really a whole lot with the gravel. I mean, I can do some with the gravel, but not really that much. I might use it as like a fill-in or something, but... Oh, I thought I ran into a tree there. I guess I kind of did, but I no, I did not run into a tree. Okay, now, now you're just... Now you're just being annoying. There we go. I don't know why I did it the other way around, but for whatever reason, my brain was like, hey, you know, the best way to do it would be to do it this way. And that would be wrong. I know that this is kind of like, I could have went this way, but I didn't want to chop through all the trees. But eventually I'll have, uh, there's like a path over there, so eventually I'll go that way with it. So that's how I'm rationalizing this highly inefficient road because yeah it would have been a lot easier to go diagonal the other way well i don't know about easier but it would have made more sense from a logistical standpoint but not necessarily easier so i would have had to trim through quite a lot of stuff oh i mean all right oh oh it's just a birch tree oh, whatever actually well never mind Let's see. Yeah, so basically I have to go until about right here. So, <laughs> I have quite a ways to go. Hmm. Interesting. so nice to not be freezing out here though i mean that was like the one of the most annoying aspects for us for quite a quite some time was the whole freezing part now the real question begins to be asked and eh, we just go up that's fine all right we're gonna head back we're gonna get on the the road here. Oh, I have a, I have a birch tree. Oh, oh, I want it to be right there. I'll trim it up. You know, probably really shouldn't put these things directly on the road, but whatever, it's fine. And then when morning comes, we'll do it all over again. And before we head back, we are going to grab this. Building those apiaries is going to be completely doable, hopefully. Where 
45. Not bad. Now, the upside to all of this, of course, is, you know, we are downside. We're going to have to move all of this up over to here, which is, you know, it's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Well, I don't have any issues with it anyway. Oh, I like that. Oh, that pine tree just grew up right there. It's very nice. Yeah, I gotta be honest, though, I don't think that door would really hold back much of anything. Ah, just put that in there. I know that there's another spot for it. It's just, you know, it's like, whatever. Um... Okay, yeah, I mean, this is, I mean, I have so much spare room, I guess you could say. Ah, darn table. Well, you gotta be getting in my way. I was kind of worried there that I wouldn't have enough food to make it through the, you know, the winter, but, uh, I'm starting to think that actually I'm gonna have too much food, which is great. It's a... Very nice problem to have, obviously. And we're back in here. Okay, so, like I said before, we know that this area... Let's see, how far over does this go? Four? And this is right here. So, three. okay, yeah, should be fine, I guess. We know that we're going to turn this little 3x3 three three room into what is basically just a massive production. Oh, that worked out great. And there we go. Three by three by three by three by three. <laughs> I'm kind of wondering here. Uh, I'm not going to stand in here. I'm just going to do it this way. Oh, yeah. I've learned my lesson. I mean, where I can anyway. Is this tall enough? Oh yeah, this this is hundred percent tall enough. Huh. Nice. Okay, I think that this this room will be fine for now. And now what we need to do is we need to start going this way and then, you know, up basically, um, so that we can, you know, properly turn this into a room and we can just walk up and then, you know, we'll seal the top, have like a, maybe a small overhang or something, and we'll just put up some of the, uh, the pine boards there to help hold it up. Should be fun. I'm going to get this. Wow, I have 35 of these? bad how's this holding out 12 days left uh yeah let me just throw that there i mean you know this this does take time why waste the time Steal it. Oops, wrong button. Okay. I don't think there was anything else I really needed from there, so it'd be good. This will be extremely narrow. So one, two over. So two. Alright, should be good. Wait a minute. Yeah, I gotta, gotta go back up there. Forgot to get the most important thing of all. Steps. Sure. Stairs are actually quite important. Who knew? Well, that didn't cave in, did it? Nope. Alright, we're good. Nice. Okay, well. 
Uh, uh. It doesn't get in the way, so I'm totally cool with it. Far up are we? We are only three up, and this is one, two, three, four. I don't really know specifically where we are, but I'm gonna see if I can't. Let's see. All right. I don't need it to be you know, at all, or, you know, ridiculous, of course. There we go. Okay. And now I just need to excavate this little area here. Nice. No, no, no. I tell you, cracked granite though, absolute worst. Okay, that'll work. I mean, you know, it's a little imperfect, but it's it's at least efficient enough that you know we can we can work with this. I don't really see a reason to keep that around. Yeah, that's just... Whatever. I uh, probably... Ah, there we go. Yeah, that's much better. Okay, cool. So now we have this, and we have our little way to walk up here, and stairs kind of suck, but, I mean... I don't... Personally, I don't really think that matters too much, and uh, it's the same, you know, height and size of the other one, and we saw how much charcoal that got us. So, and then uh, we just seal it up and then um, put that there. And when it gets up to here, we just place the last one, which will always be right there. And we're good. The smithery is complete. And now we can just focus on the road. And also, we can also focus on actual... Um, you know, like development of, say, the farms, for example, which in some aspects are probably more important than literally anything else. Uh, the farms are definitely extremely important because without them, you know, we don't really have a lot. Let's see. Wow, that is that's a lot of gravel. There's so much gravel. Yeah, have some have some random birch. I'll probably just end up turning that into like, I don't know, uh a log or something. Or firewood. Okay. Now we just need to go over here and tear it all down. And we're doing so good, too, without running into any bears of any kind. So, you know, it was a little annoying to 
encounter a bear. And also, too, like, if we wanted to make it taller, we totally can. We have the resources to, you know, make everything taller. So, like, if we wanted to have a, a much larger area for charcoal, we could totally do that. Wait, went the wrong way. I'm still not, I guess, 100%, you know, used to it. Oh. You know what I think I'm going to do instead? I'm going to put it right there. That way it's still there, but not really in my way. And I don't need this, so. I don't know why I did that. I mean, I know why I did it, but I don't know why I did that. And that is all of it. That is a lot of firewood. That is that is a lot of charcoal as well. Like I mean this is already yeah, quite a sizable chunk of it. I don't know, maybe I should put a gate here of some kind. I think I have one. Let's go get one. Uh there it is. The rough hewn gate. Looks terrible. Not very fashionable. Uh, thank you, I think. Why would it? Okay. Okay, fair enough. This will work. I can still grab stuff, open it. I mean, it's not, you know, perfect or anything, but eh, it's fine with me. And then when I want to smith, I just walk on over and get to harvesting. <clears throat> it's kind of weird. I, I really wasn't expecting to, you know, I guess get this far. Well, not really get this far, but no, no. No, that's true. I really wasn't expecting to get this far. Uh, this this was a uh, very much a surprise to me that I managed to, you know, get this far. I fully agree with that, to be honest. Want like that? And... Light it. We're gonna make another. Uh, we're gonna make another lantern, but um, no, really, yeah, I'm really surprised by how far we got in this uh, this whole set of circumstances here. You know, it's uh, it's certainly something. I think one thing I am gonna do though is I am going to put this uh, right here, and that way it'll light up here a little better. Not super great, but a little better. And, uh, how's this doing? Eh, it's, it's going, I guess. Wow, it's negative six. And it's only going to get worse, because this is just October. It's going to, it is going to get so much worse. Wow. That's crazy. You know, one thing I probably really should do it's like once I reach like a certain point, I should download all of the uh, like just all of it off of YouTube because um, I, I didn't I didn't save everything and I probably should have. And then I should like, you know, cut the that slight intro out of every single one. And then I should just speed it up like a thousand percent or something or even 1500 and then just have the vintage story like, you know, music. And then, oh, sorry, I was, see, I was talking and then I was talking. Anyway, as I was trying to say, I should just have like, you know, the whole uh, vintage story music playing. And then I can just basically like, go through and uh you know just have like the whole thing just played out i think it would look really neat every event in speed like super sped up so i don't know 
I guess we'll see. I kind of prefer this method. I don't know if it's better or if it's worse or I have no idea. It doesn't really seem like it's better and it doesn't seem like it's worse. So cool, I guess. Ugh, really? Hang on. Well, probably shouldn't make that mistake. Hmm. Well, yeah, I guess we should go on ahead and start filling all this in. Oh, no. And we'll throw that in there. And we'll throw this right over here. And we'll try to... There we go. That should be cooled. Yep. And we'll just go right up here. And we'll just put this right here. And this right here. And then this right here. And that nets us another copper lantern. Which uh, we could put like right here temporarily, but we're not obviously going to probably leave it there. Um, yeah, we're going to have to go up one. So, yeah, that'd be fun. Yeah, Got to be kind of careful, but... Mm. Yeah, that should be one, two, three, and then... Yeah, we got to kind of remove all of this. Let's see, what, what time is it in game? Oh, morning. The sun is coming up. That's that's nice. And then I think, like I said before, you know, I'm going to go out this way with it. So, should be, should be really cool. All right, let's just, uh, let's, for the last little stretch there. Let us run. I really should have brought the uh, scissors with me. That would have been... That would have been really nice to bring the scissors with me. I, I did not do that. I I should have done that, but I, I did not do that. So I'm fairly certain that later I will probably pay the price for that. But hmm. oh, it wasn't that nice. There we go. 
Heh, why not? Okay, get rid of that. Get rid of all of this. I'm sure it'll regrow. Get rid of that. It's kind of floating there. and Honestly, that kind of annoys me. We're getting to the point of being able to turn. That's handy. It's kind of crazy. Three blocks of dirt. Pretty much only netted us about as far as from what? Like here to here? Wow, it's going to require so much, like so many resources, it's not even going to be funny. I'm fine with that. It's not too much in the way. Oh, that's in the way, though. That is majorly in the way. That is a, that's a big one, too. All right, <clears throat> where do I need to start? Oh, I need to keep going. I need to, I need to get past the other one, actually. think what I'll... Seriously? I don't know why that's so different, but it is. There we go. Make it look a smidge more natural, I suppose. Yeah, let's just put that there. And then, I guess this right here, and I'll just remove all of this. Might as well take that. Give me that. Okay, perfect. And since we're about at the one hour mark, I'm just gonna dash on back before I starve to death. I don't know. Yeah, we made it pretty far. I do need to go this way with it. Hmm. Yeah, and this also... This, uh... This definitely also needs to be dealt with. I need to actually do something about this whole everything. I'm thinking about just turning it into gravel and just saying, nah, forget it. Because, I mean, look at this. Look, look, look. What? Oh. We're being severely damaged from the lack of food. Fixable. But certainly... Uh, an interesting conundrum we're having here. Not really. So, yeah. Anyway, let's just eat this really quick. You would think carrot pie would be more... I don't know, how do you say... Filling? But it's not. I'm sure getting hurt all the time does not help... Wow, almost four years. I mean, that's crazy, because... Oof, yeah, and that's just absolutely crazy. Oh, yeah. I mean, this looks great. It's going to be a beautiful forest at some point. And, yeah, we're going to come out this way, and we're going to build all of the... farms and stuff up here, and eventually, like I've said many times before, this will also get moved, and then this will basically just be this massive... Thing that I made temporarily. So that'll be good. Be able to move this. I mean, it would be nice to have, like, you know, a couple fields and rotate them. So, you know, one provides flax, the other provides, like, rye, 
And then maybe the other one's like, I don't know, producing onions or parsnips. And then we just, yeah, rotate them around. We'll also have significantly better soil, which will go a long, long way. So, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you would like to support this channel and get access to the videos early as they are uploaded, as well as a members-only area in the Discord, there is a link in the description. And there is also the big giant join button. You can click that. And yeah, that's pretty much how you do it. And I will see you all in the next one. You guys have a good one. Thanks for watching. Hey everyone, thanks for watching Raven Gaming Labs. Thanks to all the members and viewers who make RGL possible. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and don't forget to hit that bell so that you can be notified. If you want to become a member, hit the join button or link in the description below. Members get early access to videos, member-exclusive content, and more. As well, don't forget to join our awesome community over at Discord. Y'all have a good one.